I know you're gonna dig this. <laughs> Welcome to Truck of Travel. I'm Derek. I'm Cinnamon. Yeah, here we are today. We're currently in Tennessee. We're at I don't know what you want to call this. It used to be like a scale house, a way station, and now it's just truck only parking and it is very nasty. We just passed some underwear on the floor, or on the floor, <laughs> in the parking lot. She knows what she's talking about, you guys. She just mixes up words a lot, like fuel and oil. Anyway, yeah, so we wanted weird. to talk about our week. <laughs> Go ahead, Derek. All right, we started out in Ohio. We was at home and uh, we weren't able to get anything. It's been pretty slow for, well, it usually is slow January, February, March. But the whole weekend we weren't able to get a load. That's a normal thing for us. Usually the kind of loads we go after, we're not able to find those weekend loads and- uh, Oh, no, no, I didn't mean a weekend load. I mean that we weren't able to get one during the week, weekend for the week. For Monday, yeah. Yeah, for Monday or Tuesday, sorry. It's been slow, so it's <laughs> been really hard to uh, get loads. The first two weeks, um, we only got like one load each week and now this week we got, I think we did, what, two loads this week? Three? Ohio to Ohio. Oh, Ohio. okay, so we picked up in the Columbus area, <laughs> then we dropped off in the Columbus area. And A lot of action going on, but anyways, uh, so we picked up in Ohio, dropped off in Ohio, then we, not far from that, we picked up and then we dropped off in northern, <laughs> the loud one, <laughs> then we dropped off in northern uh, Illinois, and then after that we had another pickup in the Columbus area, Columbus, Ohio, and uh, it was along our route we were able to stop at home, and uh, Cinnamon got to sleep in bed, and uh, I worked out at home, so that was kind of nice. Yeah, even though it was just a brief stop, it was it was just nice, you know, just to stop in and everything. But it, it we, to walk around and be outside the truck without worrying about waking up the other person, yes. it's always nice. We were gonna stay for a little bit longer in the morning and leave a little bit later, but then we noticed we started looking at the weather map, which is very important while you're doing this job to see where you know what on what day when you're picking up where where you're picking dropping off, like completely researching what that weather is gonna be like. Um, but there was going to be like gusts of 45 miles per hour. <laughs> hey! <laughs> it beeped. Yep, better get out of this guy's way. There you go. <laughs> um, but anyways, um, we looked at the weather map and uh, it looked like a, it was going to be like 15 mile per hour winds, which is fine, but the gusts were like 45, like, uh, when we checked it at a certain spot, when I'm like, Derek, it's really windy. It said like 35 or something like that, but there's no way it was only 35. Like, oh. it, it was bad. It was like uh, there was warnings for up to 50 miles per hour, and then uh, certain parts of Ohio, there's a chance of tornadoes. And uh, we wanted to make sure that there was plenty of time for us to get to our pickup, you know, because uh, we were going to leave our house with enough time to like leave a certain amount of leeway that we usually do. But we're like, you know. Inclement weather means that you're supposed to drive slower and it was making me so mad because there was these semis that were going past me that were going above the speed limit and they were just, you Weaving know, in and out. of their own lane and getting in my lane and everything, which speaking of getting in each other's lanes. Yeah, when I was driving not too long ago, maybe about an hour ago or so, there's a semi truck that was passing us no and he was, he was right beside us for a, a little while and I think he forgot that we were there. He's just started coming into the lane like it was time and I had to lay on the old horn and uh... I was surprised you didn't say any words. Yeah. <laughs> I, Very I, proud of you. <laughs> it took me off guard. I couldn't even speak French or English so <laughs> luckily there's nobody in the side lane. It was like a you know an entrance ramp right there and uh, luckily nobody was trying to get on i was able to get over so that way we could avoid uh, a collision or whatever getting hit by this guy yeah but here we are we're still alive so that's yeah. good so we made it through the wind storms and everything like that picked up in ohio and then we went down to louisiana which i of course um in this certain area that we deliver in louisiana there's this one truck stop that has uh, really good Louisiana food and stuff. And like, this isn't necessarily Louisiana food, but I like it at this truck stop. I um, I get grits and some sausage, so. Speaking of good food, there, 
I mean, there's plenty here to choose from just in case. You're hungry. You I ain't really got anything in the truck. Stuff up. Like, I don't want to touch it, but I. I, I don't even want to pick it up. Me crazy I'm not going right to lie to you. Seeing all of this stuff it, here. It's fine where it's at. I ain't touching that crap. But the load that we dropped off in Louisiana, um, they they open up at a certain time in the morning, and we were able to get there really fast. And usually it's like packed, you know. But I, we were the only ones there this this morning, so it was very weird. Um, but they got us unloaded right away, and so we yeah, had a good awesome. delivery, fast delivery, and everything. And we got to turn around we'll probably get we're going to try to get home today because we weren't able to line up anything and uh, we got some stuff going on that we could get done at home and uh, we want to be in a good area for yeah. when we get load opportunities and stuff so it's wherever our truck is currently because yeah. it last has us in you know louisiana so it goes by your current location luckily we got the guard cat on duty here check this out Yeah. Look out, buddy. Guard cat will get you. He's the scaredy cat one, the one that like is very He's yeah, he's intimidated. pretty cautious. He's pretty cautious. <laughs> but man, it I'm just happy that we we're able to what, three loads you said this week? So that's good. It wasn't a high paying week, but you know what? For the previous two weeks compared to this week, it was a good week. Yeah. And uh yeah. I we only it's be very cold this weekend. This thing is almost paid off. What do we owe on this thing now? Uh, $5,000. I was just going to say we only owe $5,000. That's right. We only got two payments left on this sucker. Yay! And, uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. That's uh, exciting. It is exciting because we don't know what to expect because, you know, everybody's saying trucking, uh, that it's hard to make money. It's hard to make money right now because uh, fuel prices are so dang high, so... That don't help. So but if you're running under somebody's fleet, uh, something that you could do for them to be nice is to see where they get the biggest discounts and try yeah. and make it to those spots. I know certain fleet owners won't force you to go to certain spots, even though it would help them. But yeah. something you could do to help you, them help you. Like, you know what I mean? Like It helps you keep a job yeah. because you're not running them out of business. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So that's a good idea. Yeah. But with our truck, you know, soon to be paid off, that'll help us uh, if the fuel costs go up higher. You know what I mean? Or if there's more breakdowns, that'll help us have money aside for that. But I don't know. Cinnamon's it's cold. Getting cold. <laughs> Cinnamon's cold. It looks nice outside. It does. But it's like in the 30s, I think, isn't it? Yeah. It's not awesome. And Cinnamon has flip flops on. Cinnamon makes bad decisions sometimes. I like flip flops. I like to stay warm.
trucks for a living, reach out to Highfield Trucking at the link and phone number in the video description. Let them know Truck and Travel sent you. Come on.